You have seven players on each side of the field, um, and then you have subs on the sidelines. Um, every player has a broom, obviously. Um, we use PVC pipes; they're lighter and they're smaller, and you don't hit anybody with a, you know, a bunch of bristles. Um, and then you also wear headbands. Uh, headband denotes the position you're playing: green headband for keeper, white for chaser, black for beater, and yellow for seeker. There's four positions: seven players on a team, uh, three chasers, two beaters, a keeper, and a seeker. Uh, the chasers work to move the quaffle, which is a deflated volleyball, um, and put it through one of the three hoops on either side, on, on their side of the field. Um, every time they get through one of the hoops, it's worth 10 points. The keeper tries to defend them and stop them from getting it through the hoops. Uh, I play keeper with uh, our team. And uh, basically, I stand in front of the three hoops and stop the balls from going in. And uh, I like keeper because you play a lot of offense, kind of like soccer. You move up with a like a defenseman would, but you fall back on defense as well. So you're basically a midfielder almost, midfield or goalie. It's a good way to put it. Uh, beaters are they play both defensive and offensive, uh, but mainly they're they're defensive. They play with bludgers. Uh, in Muggle Quidditch, bludgers are, are deflated dodgeballs, and there's three dodgeballs, uh, three bludgers, four beaters. Um, the main goal we hold them and our objective is to take our bludgers and hit other players in order to knock them out of play for a few minutes in order to give our team a better advantage of getting control of Waffle and to prevent goals from scored. The Seeker tries to catch the snitch. The Seekers we play with mostly in tournaments. Um, you can't really anticipate what Seekers do because they're responding to the snitch. And the snitch is supplied by um, the IQA, which is the International Footage Association. And they supply a snitch that does essentially whatever it wants. And the seekers just have to go and chase them. The, uh, the golden snitch is a person who wears all yellow. And he wears a sock on his belt. Uh, and the seekers have to try to wrestle with the snitch and grab the sock out of his belt. Game play usually runs from about 20 minutes to maybe an hour and a half. Uh, it's based on how long it takes to catch the snitch. Uh, the game doesn't end until the snitch is caught, and that's worth 30 points. Who's in charge of this? Who started the whole club? Uh, that would go to Eric Schneier. He is the president, founder, and team captain, and a whole bunch of other titles that I really don't know anymore. There, there was a Facebook group for people who were interested at FSU. And uh, I joined the group, and uh, one day I just decided I was tired of waiting for someone else to do it, and I posted that we were going to try to make some hoops and have a practice, so we did. And uh, we started off with four people who came out to the first practice. We're up to around 30 members uh, who come consistently, and then we've got uh, maybe 10 others who come every now and then. Uh, teams in the state of Florida, it's actually growing. It used to be eight, but now we're up to actually 10. Um, all the major schools, so USF, UF, Miami, FSU obviously, uh, then there's uh, UCF now, FAU, FIU, Brevard County College actually now has one, Ringling and Rollins also have teams, and I think New College is actually starting one up, and that's all in, just in the state of Florida alone. Uh, naturally, there's way too many conferences, and every school could just start one up if they really felt like it. I think... To me, the best part about this team is that past being a sports team and, and being teammates and, and being competitive, uh, the team is really a family. We all hang out outside of Quidditch. The vast majority of my friends are all on the team. We hang out all the time. We, we go to dinner after every practice. They're, they're my best friends at the school, and, and we, we're, we're a family. And it's, it's really unlike anything else we've ever done.